everyone and welcome to the magical world of pyrography. Actually, I've planned another video for this week, but I wasn't happy about how my work looked, so I decided to do something completely different. In this video, you can see a bit too much of my black scarf, which I use as a background, so I'm using a bit of overlay fire to mask it. Let's make a portrait of someone who created a truly magical world. John Ronald Rule Tolkien, and in my opinion, it is appropriate to burn his portrait on a wooden bookmark. I guess I don't have to describe the amazing legacy of Tolkien, you know it quite well. But I can honestly tell you that his works have been my companion since my childhood. I remember very well how I borrowed The Lord of the Rings from a school library and how careful I had to be while reading the books during breaks. I was bullied at school, so when I was trying to read, someone would try to pull my chair or just kick me, that's why I had to protect the book with my whole body so that it wouldn't get damaged. But nevertheless, the world of Middle Earth was a welcome escape from the horrors of my school. for shading as well, because this wood is just perfect for making precise and smooth values. But of course, I cannot do without my spoon pen too, when it comes to shading bigger surfaces. I think that the portrait starts looking quite good now.
I'm going to make the background dark to make his face stand better out. He has white hair, so you can tell that they are white only if everything around is darker. Each monochrome piece looks bright with high contrast. personal stories about the works of Tolkien, but if I tell them all, this video is going to be way too long. I remember that when I was studying at the Linguistic University, I learned to appreciate Tolkien's knowledge about old languages and his ability to invent complex languages of his own. was so impatient with the background that I completely forgot to leave some space for smoke from the pipe. Well, let's see if I can get it right. I guess I'll just use a white marker for smoke in the end.
this, I use my spear pen. I'm trying to make it look in a bit like Tolkien's signature. With my white bead artist pen brush, I draw all kinds of highlights. And finally, I burn a hole in a bookmark to insert a tassel. And here is my finished bookmark. I really hope you like this video. If so, please support me with your likes, subscribe, click the bell button, leave me some comments too, and I will be very happy to welcome you next week in my new video. Send you a lot of inspiration. Bye!